in front. And Kay's behind the camera. And this is our Warm Wishes Christmas Pocket Album that we did at our Wandsford workshop. And we're just going to do a little walkthrough with, with this. So these papers are absolutely lovely. It was a really lovely collection. I didn't like it when I first saw it, but as you work with it, you like it more and more. So this is the front cover. It opens out. There's a pocket here. And then your album actually fits inside this pocket here. So it's all a nice self-contained project. And we have got the um, complete pocket album kits. So a little bit of fussy, fussy cutting on the front. That's the spine. And then on the back, we've got a, a goldy color. I think we used an eight by eight pad. We used half a pack of patterns and solids and two of the um, ephemera pages from the 12 by 12. So when you have a look at this, you've got your pocket on the front and you can see I've embellished lots of things with glossy accents because it would be rude not to pocket there and these are all pocket pages inside here it's a tad towards you these two pages here I've put um, little decorative strips down the spines there what did you use on those then? oh what did I use I think I used our perfect precision die strips Kay did you? Mm, called wrench ones <laughs> yes wasn't it? that wasn't rehearsed <laughs> Okay, and I've used our curved photo slot set one here. So these means you can take the, take the pictures out, put other things in. But you've also got a pocket there and you've got a pocket there. So there's lots of storage in this album to hold all sorts of things for you. Let's pop that in there. Again, that's put your tabs inside. In here, we've used our walrus whiskers just to create diagonal corner pockets, which will work like that and like that it was quite um i did it so the page is mirrored and so we had some quick catch-up pages and then a bit more of an intense page so this is a bit more of an intense page so again they mirror each other glossy accents on our page tabs um i did double glossy accents there because i was too impatient and touched it beforehand and i had to finger mark but i really like it because it's really domed compared to that one so i should be using even more glossy accents now so photo mats there and then here we've got a little pocket here and we've also got a pocket here and then exactly the same concept on this side and once I've made the pages I went through and um, cut little elements out just to decorate the pages and then on the last page that's a pocket there that's one of the larger images from the 12 by 12 ephemera used the walrus whisker to cut a little tuck spot there and when we talk about tuck spot that's so it's virtually like an invisible pocket and then we've got another pocket here and then we've got another pocket here and you had loads of papers left over so you can make lots of things with it and the pdf for this will be available on our website thank you okay thank you bye, bye.